Students playing around with computers is a common sight these days. But this is no game. These children are actually learning the basics of coding. It's fun. <laughs> and when, when, when someone says coding, you think it's like really, really, really hard. And then like, you just go up to people and say, I know how to code. <laughs> This key skill is now compulsory in all schools in the United Kingdom from the age of five. It's not just about learning lines and lines of programming text. The tools these children are using are much more user-friendly and even ties in with their other lessons. So our year six children have been learning to code uh, using a program called Scratch and they're, they're designing a labyrinth for the Minotaur because they're learning about ancient Greece. So, you know, it, it's fantastic. Um, yes, it's a bit scary for teachers because it's something that they've not done in the past. Um, but I think what we're doing here is, is, is embracing that by uh, doing it alongside the children. You know, we're learning with them. The government overhauled the computing curriculum after industry figures warned that children were not learning the skills they needed to compete in the 21st century. The hope is that these children will find jobs in the information technology sector worth £58 billion annually. The UK is predicted to have a deficit of 249,000 technology workers by 2020. I think that everybody sees it as a challenge and uh, I love Barack Obama's quote about those who out teach us today, out um, compete us tomorrow and this is a real challenge for education globally and we just want to make sure that Britain is doing it better or at least as well as everybody else. Other countries are already considering similar classes. France, for example, is offering programming to primary school pupils, but as an optional extracurricular activity. Britain hopes that by making classes mandatory, they'll make sure the country doesn't become a technological dinosaur.